In today's video we're going to survive for 24 hours in a 100 populated server on Russia completely solo. We will raid, defend our base from a toxic 3 man team, PvP and getting insane loot while building a strong base. Make sure to drop a like to show your support and subscribe to not miss any future videos. Last video's mythical giveaway winner is shown now and today we're going to throw another one which is an electric headdress. To win this make sure that you have liked, subscribed and comment something below. Channel members also have higher chance of winning. Alright boys we are in completely naked solo have absolutely nothing except my propeller head and my parrot and we already hear shots okay actually there are there's a bow kit you know what that's actually not that bad at least we we'll start something off try to kill the sports show, dude i already see a billion bases at spawns which usually shows that there's actually gonna be people all around now the server is actually extremely popular there's almost 100 players on the server and i've been giving it a look here and there and it looks like this server is always active so i think oh there's a these right there Let's get a bit closer. I don't know if there's a bullet drop, and I don't think that there is. Yep, he is dead. First kill completed. And okay, he has some stuff. There's a stacking mod by the looks of it, so I'll take that. Yeah, the sawed off. Let's get ourselves this backpack. A lot of scrap. My guy has 20 scrap. He has an axe, which is. Oh, I already had an axe from the kit. And we've got ourselves a Schofield, which is actually perfect. I love that gun. But yeah, I've been looking at the server for a while, it's always active, so it may be a bit hard for us to progress. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to split myself into two bases. We'll get ourselves a starter base, there's somebody shooting a hawk count close. But yeah, I'll build myself a starter base close down here, where I get myself some loot. Somewhere to store, he's right there, I don't know what he's shooting at, what is he doing? Is he just wasting ammo? Yeah, my guy's just standing there, there we go, hit him. Yeah, he, he's dead. Alright, perfect. But yeah, so I'm gonna build a small base somewhere around here at the bottom of the map so that I do have somewhere to store and then I do have a plan of where I want to build it. I am going to go all the way to the north of the map, Crowvy, and there is a military tunnel there and I'm gonna build it behind it. Hopefully there are no bases around there. This dude had some guns. I'll take the locale box for sure. We'll take the Hawk Hound 2 and the Schofield, get ourselves an extra magazine for it. Hawk Hound is empty, get ourselves a bedroll too, which is good. But I'm probably gonna build uh, my first base. Somewhere around the island, one of these little islands around. Till we get a chainsaw, maybe we'll get ourselves some good loot. And then we'll transfer all of the loot to the second base, which I'll build. And hopefully I won't get raided by then. We're gonna try to survive for 24 hours on the survey without getting raided, playing non-stop. Hopefully we won't lose all of our stuff. Today's video is sponsored by Pine Hosting. Are you guys trying to set up your own network for Unturned? Then look no further because I got the best option for you which is Pine Hosting. Pine Hosting is very easy to learn, the navigation is super user friendly and not hard at all to master. The servers all have high performance with DDoS protection. When I started my own network a while ago I had no clue how to do anything but after a few minutes of looking around I learned the basics shortly. They have locations all around the world and the pricing is super worth it. They also have a variety of game servers to choose from including Rust, Arc and also Minecraft. A game changing feature is the ability to install plugins and mods just by clicking once. Also if you have a server with another provider you don't have to worry because Pine Hosting will help you move your servers. Make sure to check out the link below and use the code LGG for 30% off and let's get straight back into the action. Alright, so now it's chopping trees time. We're gonna build somewhere around here. I see so many bases, it's crazy. Everywhere we go, there's unraided bases. So there's gonna be base raiding galore on the server. Which is actually good, so my base won't get targeted since it would be the only unraided base around. But since there's a lot, it's really good. Alright, so now it's base building, chopping trees time. I'll probably build like a small 1x2 or something like that for now. Maybe two floors. Because I don't know how long I'll be down here until I build the second base. I'll probably die a million times trying to get to the top. There's people here at the farm. I'm gonna try to kill him. Hit him. Hit him again. Oh, I missed. There we go, he's dead. Hit him. Oh, I can't reload. Bro, come here. Hit him. Bro, he has a chainsaw. Bro, I have nothing. I don't have a magazine. 
And I'm dead. Alright, first death. Oh, I really wanted to get that kill. He had a chainsaw. I have still the sword off in my base. I'm gonna try to go back. That's literally right next to my base, too. So perhaps. Yeah, we're back. Yeah, I left the locale here, bro. I'm so stupid. It's fine, though. Let's get the monster key and let's head back. Let's try to kill him. Should probably do some honeycombing when I'm back to maybe make an airlock. So if I'm getting door camped, I wouldn't die and lose all of my loot that easily. If I get this kill, that would be great because then I can start progressing up. Because I really need that chainsaw for me to build the main base. Sort of chopping down trees. Obviously, I will leave the smaller base down here. But right now, let's not really focus on that. Right now, let's focus on getting these kills. Especially the chainsaw. I could just kill him, vault it, and that's it. And he's right here. He's dead. Where's the second dude? He's somewhere out there. I hear him. Oh, he hit me, bro. I hit him. He jumped off. Bro, he's running away from me, man. He still has the bow. He's right there. He missed. And he is dead. Alright, blasted. Yep, we got the chainsaw. He had a lot of locale. That's really good. Oh, there's a naked dude coming here. Alright, we gotta kill him. Yeah, he's... What? He's trying... Did he pick up a gun? I think he got my skull field. Now he's running away. Come back here, bro. What? You're not dead? Alright, now he's dead. Yeah, he just picked up some clothes and some food. Nothing too good. Alright, yeah, never mind. I had the skull field this whole time. Alright, lovely, we got the chainsaw. They have so many meds, Jesus. They salvaged every single clothes. But yeah, loot is normal. Zombies drop normal loot, not high times loot. It's basically just a semi vanilla server. So it's not gonna be that easy to progress on getting raiding gear and all of that. So we got a steely, so that's good. I'm over here trying to get a blowtorch more than anything. There's chemicals as well. Let's take the chemicals. Come on, bro, die. There we go, flashlight. Bro, since it's high time, oh, there's somebody around. Yeah, my guy's here. He has a chainsaw. Hit him. And he is dead. Whenever you kill someone on the server, there's like a coin sound effect. I don't know why. It's just weird. <clears throat> one of these could drop a blowtorch. Oh, there we go. We got one. Let's see what this dude had. Uh, crossbow, hawk hound, and a chainsaw. Second chainsaw. Beautiful. Lovely. Let's go. <clears throat> yeah, we got what we needed from here. I'll actually take that chemical just in case I'll do a horde or claim flags. Which I probably will do a claim flag if I'm gonna build a, a fortress. Alright, so my next step is I'm trying to get a god. Oh, I'm getting shot at. He's right there. Hit him. Bro, I can't move around with this thing in front of me. I got a mad. I don't have them binded, bro. I'm trying to get a gauss mask, and there's a dude right in front of me. What is he doing? Is he pushing around? What? He hit me? Hit him. How is he not dead? Bro, how. Dude, how is he not dead? I hit him. I... What? Bro, I hit him so many times. I know some stuff there. Bro, there's so many people on, man. Everywhere I go, there's people. Even if I'm literally underwater somewhere, I'll probably see people. Or I'll probably start doing the journey at the top then, since we got the chainsaw. All I gotta do is just arrive there with a chainsaw, build a one by one, and place a bed. That's literally it. And we'll leave this base how it is. But we got a filter, so that's good. Put everything in here, and we'll just come collect them later on. There's a dude there. I think that's the guy that killed me, actually. Alright, headshot. Yeah, yes, hawk hunt. There we go, he's dead. Yeah, it is the same guy that killed me. Oh, good, we got our stuff back. Perfect. Anything good, bucko? Yep, chainsaw and hawk hound. Well, definitely use the hawk hound. We got ourselves a locale box for it, so it's pretty good. Let's mud up and keep going to where we want to build our main base. There's a base here. There's a bed. Wait, what? My guy's in here. Bro, he's dead. Oh, Bulldog. There we go. Blowtorch. He has base parts. <laughs> I, I took his doors. Yeah, let's just keep... Actually, you know what? We could camp his bed. I'm gonna wait for him to respawn. And he'll go to the lockers. If he has a gun, he'll take it out and we'll kill him again. Alright, let's put all of this junk in here. I don't wanna lose it, especially the Bulldog. Yeah, he's back. Yeah, he hit him. I think he took out something from the... What is he doing, bro? What is he doing, bro? Stop moving around. There we go. Yeah, yeah, he... Alright, he took out just a Chris correct. Alright, let's destroy his bed then. He took out a Chris Kirk. He doesn't have anything better in his inventory then. So let's just keep going on. Right, there we go. Easy bulldog. Finally, we have an auto gun. Alright, so this is where we want to build our base. For now, I'm just gonna put a bed. Now, I did loot the military area, and I actually got sniper skin and bulldog, which is pretty good, considering it's normal loot. Let's actually build a little further up. Yeah, there's a base up here. I was thinking of building it behind this rock, actually. There's a brick base all the way back there, so 
But somewhere, I hope this base is raided so we don't have to worry about it, to be honest. But yeah, I think it's raided. We also got a coin card from Krovis, so in terms of guns, we're good. We do have a few guns. Yeah, this base is completely destroyed. That's good. Yeah, we could build it somewhere here then, right on this little hill. Or behind it, actually. Yeah, and all our people will go here. We're close to a military area, close to Krovi, close to the dead zone, which I'll definitely be doing runs there. But yeah, this is where we're going to start building. So now it's time to do... A bunch of more chopping, at least now we have a chainsaw. Alright, so I'm back at the first base. And I'm here to take everything. You should take the blowtorch mainly and the steely. I don't care about anything else. Hey, go kid star for clothes. I think there's a cooldown on a bow kid, bro. That's actually kind of scary because that means that you'll never see naked. They always have a bow. And bows aren't really that weak either. Two shots and the player's dead. But I got everything. So now I'm gonna home and I'll probably never come to this base ever again. Unless I spawn down here or something. I'm gonna take some of the wardrobes with me. The dog, what? It vanished. Oh, and I am dead. All right, there goes my calling card. Bro, there's people roof camping, I think. I was going to go Moscow. Let's just kill this dude. Man, shut up. Yeah, I was going to go to Moscow to try to get myself a gas mask, but I guess we'll have to go to the Firewatch Towers instead. So let's do that next. Yo, I got a truck. Having a vehicle on a 100-player server is literally suicide, but I'm gonna use it for me to get to the... Firewatch Tower, actually. Got myself a Sniper's kit, so, so that's pretty good. Uh, there's multiple people there. Hit him. Hit him, one's dead. Bro, I can't see because of this thing in front of me, man. Hit him. There's like three dudes. There's four dudes, I think. There's a lot of people, yeah. Alright, two dudes are dead. I gotta push in. I gotta bring my truck, and I gotta reverse it. Yeah, there's more. I hear them. He's right there. I think there's another dude. What? Is he trying to shoot a Vanya at me from here? There's a third dude dead. Yeah, there's still one more guy, but they're probably all gonna TP. So I gotta take the truck, and I gotta reverse it. I just put it head on, because I cannot build plates on the server. Like, you cannot build plates on the floor, if that makes sense. So there we go. We just do this jump, and let's just push up. We have the Bulldog for close range, and he has a Vonya, so I actually gotta be a bit careful. But I do want that Vonya. Alright, well, this dude had a Chainsaw Monster key. Yeah, he's coming back. He's naked, though. Picking up a blue pile there. He's dead. I gotta kill the, the Vonya dude. I don't know where he is, though. He was somewhere around here. We'll loot them at the end. I just wanna get rid of all of them. There's a few zombies here. Where the hell did he go, man? Oh, he's out here. I saw him. Yeah, he's TPing back, obviously. Alright, one of them is dead. Oh, he has a Chris Karek. And he is dead. Alright. So I think I cleared them all. The others didn't manage to TP or something. Let's kill out all the zombies. Let's kill them all. There we go. There we go. We got some locale. Alright, I think they're all dead now. Yep, Vanya. Beautiful. There's another Vanya. Two Vanyas. Okay. Blowtorch. Yeah, we have a full inventory. So I think I'm gonna actually depot and base. There's still this, uh, the other loot part that I didn't check, but I don't think they have anything that good. It seems like there's mostly civilian loot. I think all of this loot, they got it from like the bottom of the map and from the airport itself. Yeah, this dude had uh, nothing good. He had the bow kit. Let's check out what the loot pile over here had. Yeah, I killed them somewhere around here. I right, had sport shot, crossbow, and a Chris Karak. That's literally it. Umbrella. Oh, gas mask. There we go. Perfect. All right. That's actually really good. I got vault this really quickly. Wait, where is it? Oh, hold on. There we go. It's vault. I could literally leave. I'm gonna kill the rest of the zombies though, so maybe they'll drop a filter, so I don't have to come back later on because I'm gonna do multiple dead zone runs. 100%. Oh, we got a gas mask. It's not really that early, but we got it instantly, kind of. All right, we're back in base. Got three wardrobes that are almost all full. Just got a little bit more here and there. Got two lockers too, finally, so... 
Now we do have a bit of secured loot. We're gonna drop all of these except the gas mask and the filter, and we're just gonna put them in here. Got two raw, which is perfect for one charge. Obviously, we still need grenades and all of that. And that's almost importantly. But yeah, we're gonna go for another run. We're gonna go to the military tunnels as always, and very soon we'll go do a dead zone run as well. Our first dead zone run, hopefully we won't die. Oh, that's all. Oh my god, what? Okay, I'll take that. Put that in vault. Okay, now that is actually insane. We got two Zebecs on this run too. It's just really, really good, bro. I can start roaming Zebec now. Bro, what's a run? We haven't even looted anywhere else except this tunnel. This is why I built here. Normal loot, but look at all of this loot I'm getting. I always get high tier loot here every single time I go. It's like it's buffed or something. I don't know, man. It's crazy. All right, dead zone time brought bulldog silencer. So if there's people around, like waiting for them to hear shots in the dead zone so they could counter it, won't be that easy, I guess. I really, really hope I get good stuff from here, man. If I get grenades, I'm happy because we can start doing some small raids already. Some raw explosives, some ammo. Come on, bro, die. There we go. Let's take that raw 100%. Get ourselves another silencer. That's really good, actually. Anything in here? Nope. Nothing. All right, so let's go to the main area now. Check out maybe the tower. Maybe it does have something good. And it looks like there is absolutely nothing. All right, lovely. Let's just jump off, go with our umbrella. Wait, what is this? Oh, there's a spec up Strexic. Oh, good. All right, upgrade. If I get all spec from here, I'm going to be happy. So let's do drop a helmet. We already have one, but easy metal. I'm trying to get metal too, so I can make lockers and start upgrading base to full metal. That's something that I will try to do, at least the low room. Probably after this dead zone run, I'll work a little bit on base. Make it a little bit more defended, because right now it's very small. It's one charge away from being blown up, and we're gonna have dead zone loads, so... We need to have it well defended. Got another bulldog mag. Let's do drop that knife. Adaptive, that's actually great! And high cal, okay. Wait, I didn't take it. Oh, I have a full inventory. Oh, it's because I have some clothes, that's why I yeah, salvage all of them. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna take a filter out of my vault because soon it's, I'm gonna have to pop it. If there's gonna be a lot of zombies down here, they may actually, like, corner me and I'll die. So let's just hotkey it. Oh yeah, there are a few zombies. And yep, now the silencer broke, so all the zombies are coming. Let's just switch. Oh, there's a mega zombie, bro. Oh, that's good. That could give us grenades easy easily. Yeah, we have no more silence now. I'm gonna pop the filter soon. I could switch to Fussy Lot if I want to, but I'll uh, use Bulldog magazines for now. Since in PvP, I won't really be using it. Come on, man! we will get another Bulldog. Oh, Where's the like a zombie, bro? Is he stuck somewhere? Alright, let's pop the filter. Oh, yeah, he's coming. I hear him. Yeah, he's right here. Alright. He's, he's stuck. Yeah, we gave him a lot of damage there. Destroying rocks. Reload, reload. And he's dead. And grenades! Perfect. Imagine I got a dragon thing though, but grenades are equally as good. Each grenade is one charge. Alright, let's check out what that's at the bottom. We think we cleared out all of the zombies. Let's med up, get to full HP. Anything good in here? Nope. Nothing. La nice. Reload. Some ammo. More ammo. Let's refill our bulldog mags. This is a good run though. I'm happy we got the grenades. That's really the important thing. Just kinda hoping for better guns though. We got a lot of ammo from this run, man. Looks like so many ranger mags. A beret. Oh, and the back. Oh, great. That's good. We got ourselves the best backpack. Let's check out these rooms at the side now. Maybe they'll have something else. And then we'll just get out of here. We'll go to base. Yeah, there's nothing else in here, right? right let's vote the grenades and uh, other stuff that I don't want to lose just in case I die somehow. This is the final room we have to check. But there's nothing. Just clothes and a scope. All right, let's leave. All right, so I just finished another run. Uh, went to melee, the military tunnel, went to Crow V, and I got myself some good stuff, especially raw. So we're gonna do charges, we already can do charges. We've been in the server for around like 3 hours, and we can do 2 charges. Which is, you know what, not that bad, considering there is over 100 people on the server. And we got ourselves, hold on, we gotta put this raw on our ventry toe, and second charge. So now I'm probably gonna spend the next few minutes looking around the map, seeing what I can raid. And picking a target. There's a lot of bases, so I gotta try to find myself the best one possible. Obviously with the least amount of raiding supplies. So I found this base. Uh, it's at the edge of the dead zone, meaning it could actually have good loads. Since it's all the way up here. It's only birch. 
So these guys probably did dead zone runs. And we're through, yep. And looks like those two lockers, okay. Well, it's not really looking too good, but maybe these lockers will clutch up. Our first bait trade, let's see what we get. And, okay, I see stuff. Okay, you know what? I'll take that. Even though the ghost mosques are empty, that's okay. Get ourselves a lot of high tier guns. Two Night Traders, Zub and uh, Mikarev. I'll take that. Get ourselves a Spec Ops vest, so I'll definitely wear that instead. But the empty Ghost Musks can be important just in case I die with the current Ghost Musk I have. All I would need is just a filter and that's it. Alright, so I'm gonna take everything and I'm gonna home. First base trade, you know what, not that bad. Considering we only use two charges, obviously the next trade I'll try to get a be better raid. A bigger base, but we still have to regrind everything, but... Yeah, I'll take these, I'll take these guns. They're good, they're good to have. There's a dude down there. Oh, he's so low, bro. I'm coming for you. What? He went the other side. <laughs> there we go, he's dead. He thought I was shooting him from the other side, probably. Alright, he had a snake Perskia and some Bulldog Mags, that's it. Alright, boys, it is time for our second dead zone run. This time I'm going Zubek. And got myself a lot of ammo for it. Hopefully I will get a better one than the previous one. Hopefully I'm a zombie. And hopefully, a lot of loot. Wait, I hear Highbreaker shots, bro. Wait, I think there are people in the dead zone. I'm gonna go for it, obviously. I'm gonna try to kill him, but if I die, I would just actually lose myself a pretty good outfit. Especially Spec Ops, got the chainsaw with me, so... But I'm gonna try to get the kill, obviously. If we get the kill, that's an easy Goss Musk. Oh yeah, he's right there. Bro, he's clueless! There we go, he's dead. I really hope he's a solo, though. I really hope his buddy isn't around. Check out what loot he has. Please, something good. Oh yeah, he's geared! Bro, look at this. Full Goss Mask. My guy just popped a filter. Oh, card breaker. Spec Ops vest. That's huge. Bro, we just he just looted the horde the dead zone for me, man. I'm gonna check out just in case he missed anything though. Because you can never trust people. If there's any zombie oh yeah, there are zombies. Yeah, he didn't loot the full dead zone then. That's really good. Anything good in here? Grenade, perfect. I came here mainly for grenades, to be honest. Night vision. Come on, give me the good load. Yeah, this one is definitely better than the first run we did. 100%. We have a full inventory, man. And I cannot salvage anything. I think I'm gonna home and then I'll come back in like 30 minutes. And loot would have probably respawned. Another death hole? Bro, what? Yo, that's an easy horde. Wait, we're gonna have to ditch the snipers. Yeah, fussy lot. Well, I don't really like that gun, so I'll just leave it here. Attachments. Let's pop this bad boy, and let's get out of here. Alright boys, it is time to go do our second base raid. Got myself a few charges. I also did upgrade the base, by the way. It is like now a tower, and up here it's a 2x3, but I do plan on expanding it even more. Currently, it's just what it is, though. But yeah, I should have more than enough to make multiple C4. Yep, sticky, charge, and I need glow. Do I not have glow? Oh, I have glow in my vault, alright. Another sticky, another charge, and we got ourselves three charges, which is, you know what, not that bad. Definitely an upgrade from the first raid. <laughs> Alright, so we just found this base raid. Looks quite prom promising, actually. Yeah, we're gonna give this raid a try. Got three charges, it's wood, so it should be more than enough to go through. Let's hope we'll raid into the loot room, though. We'll put it there so the wall and the roof will break. Alright, here we go. Yeah, that did all- okay, well... What? It's like a base in a base. 
Bro, there's so many beds in here. All right, well, chemicals, there's some wardrobes, uh, an umbrella. Okay, well, not really looking good, but uh, there's some of these modded lockers. I don't know how much they take, man. I still have two ch charges. Let's destroy the beds, obviously. It's a three-man base. It's a trio. So they're bound to have something good in these lockers, right? Can't even get out. Yeah, I can't get out. I'm stuck. But it's fine. We'll raid these lockers. Let's get rid of this tree. I really hope nobody actually heard me raid. Don't try to counter because we're kind of close to Crowvy here. Yeah, if we destroyed the roof, we could be able to get up, but... It's whatever, man. Let's take both of the charges out. Let's put it in the big one. Maybe the smaller ones will break by the range as well. And none of them broke. Nice. Oh, there's another locker down there. What? Okay. Let's put it back. At least if the smaller ones break, that's good enough. And yeah, they did break. Okay. And this one has some guns, Vanya ammo. Yeah, just a bunch of ammo by the looks of it. Got a drum. High cal. All right, not really that good. Um, that's not really good, unfortunately. But the larger locker is still here, which is probably where the good loot is. But we're going to have to farm a little bit more. We're just going to have to get some grenades and some raw. And we will return to this raid. And hopefully it'll have good stuff, man. Because this one is not, doesn't really have anything that good. Dead zone run number three. Hoping for grenades, raw explosives. Dragon Fang, whatever. Just give me something that raids, man. That's all I want. Back from the run, and we did get grenades, which is what I needed, but I gotta go get raw, so I'm gonna do a run over the tunnel. Now, I did place the wall in a way, the doorway, if you guys just realized. I wouldn't be able to go back in, so if I'm getting door camped, people cannot get in. It's kind of genius, and I recommend you guys to do it every single base you have. Build it on a hill, and make sure that the doorway is too high up for people to go in. Obviously, make sure that the server has home, though, or else you're kind of stuck down there. Man, there's a guy there, dude. Green skin. Let's take him out. There we go, he's dead. Let's check out what loot he had. He seemed like he had a gun. I think it was Zubek, actually. Let's check out if this group is in a, in a group. Oh yeah, he is. He's in a duel. I gotta be careful then. His buddy may be lurking somewhere around. If I die, don't lose anything that insane, though. Yeah, his buddy is here. And Zubek. Some pants and some lot of ammo. But yeah, we got two charges. We're going to go finish that big locker raid. Come on, man, please break. I did break, great. And, okay, there's a lot of loot in this one. Much more loot than the other one. Let's put the charge and the detto back, but... Three high cal boxes, fussy lot detonators. That's good. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Detonators and Isa Horde. The high cal is good if we get a meta or an echo. Which they do spawn on this map, but... Yeah, not too bad. We still got another charge, too. So, um, I won't complain. Where's the dude there? Is that, oh, this is the duo, the, the other dude that I killed. It's his buddy. Snape Herskia. That looks good. Fully attached. Right, let's run back to base. These guys are starting to come close to base. I think they live nearby. Because I killed them both, but very different times. Oh, yeah, we got ourselves an ice back too. That's nice. Oh, he's right there. Dead. Yeah, it's Demic. Oh, my God. Oh, he was behind me, bro. Oh, they got me. Yeah, they, they live near... That guy's running with a ghost mask around. What? Okay. I'll try to kill him, but... Yeah, it's a duo, and I think they live nearby, man. I really think they do. And yeah, they're both here. They both TP'd. Let's go back with Zob. Could take the attachments from the Sfusilot, Laser, and uh, 8X. And let's go back. Oh, bro, they were literally waiting for... They know where I live. Probably gonna get door camp then. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I'm gonna die. He's behind me? What? How? Yes, yeah, his other dude. Yeah. He's up there. Bro, I have no meds on me. This is terrible. He's there. Oh, bro, he didn't see me. Okay, we got him both then. Yep. Fully decked out Zub. We gotta find the first dude that I killed as well. I have no idea where I killed him. Oh, there it is. We found his little body. Yep, I got all my stuff back. And the gauze mask, bro. My guy was running around with a gauze mask. What an idiot. Alright, so we got a plan for my base upgrades. I'm gonna make shutters and windows so I could just stay in my base, make sure people aren't door camping me before I jump off, you know? Hey, sure. Oh, 
they found out where I live. They're outside speaking. This is terrible, bro. They're gonna dork him, man. 100%. Okay, so this is the situation. They are camping me from both sides. There's a dude with a sniper skill on the hill somewhere. This guy just won't shut up. And there are three now. There are trio. They were a duo at the start. There are trio. Uh, I don't know what they're trying to do. I, they may try to raid me. I have no idea what he is saying, honestly. I don't know what he's saying. Oh, I got him both. Close the door. Let's take all of his loot. I don't know where he's putting the guns that I had. I, I lost an AUG, man. But it's whatever. I just don't want them here, bro. Oh, wait. I got my AUG back. Never mind. Oh, they're... Bro, they're coming with stairs. I don't have a claim flag, man. Oh, he hit me. Yeah, they're a trio. One of them... One of them is trying to build up with stairs. One of them is sniping. And one of them is camping with Zubek. I don't know how I'm gonna win this, man, honestly. I need them to reach good or something. I need to kill all the three of them or something. Hit him. And he's hiding now. They're TPing back, bro. This is impossible. There's no way I'm beating this. Yeah, one of them is literally pushing up with stairs. I gotta try to kill the sniper first. And he's just hiding, bro. I got... Ow, that hurt. Oh, they're placing stairs, yeah. My right, sniper is dead. I'm gonna try to jump off. Y yeah, this dude is just hiding, bro. He's camping me out, man. Oh, they got they All three of them got guns now. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I lost the base, man. Let's close the door. Well, I don't know what to take. Let's take Zubac. Let's take Mag. I could try to do something stupid, but... If I lose it, I'll lose everything. Alright, he's dead. I had shot him. Where is he? Yeah, they're building right under me, man, with stairs. Yeah, this dude is still hiding. Oh my god, man. Should I leave with all of the loot? Should I just combat log? Three-man team camping me out, trying to go deep in my base? I'm not gonna do that, obviously. I'm still gonna try to fight them, but don't think I'll win, man. Let's close that before they manage to get in. Do I even have any more guns? Yeah, we have a zoo back there, but... We have the Heartbreaker. Okay? I got this Heartbreaker from that dude in the uh, dead zone, but... Gonna give another try with the Zub. Let's reload. I'm running out of guns. So that's gonna be an issue. I'm gonna salvage this wall. Maybe I'll get a peek. But... Yeah, that dude is still sniping there. Let's just replace it. Yeah, he's still just there. He's not gonna move from there. He's just camping me out. Man, shut up. He's, he's still... I don't know what he's saying. Alright, so... This is the stupid plan I have. I'm gonna salvage this wall. If they kill me, they could go in. And they would be one door away from my bed. But I'm gonna give it a try. He's right there. Yep, he's dead. Uh, oh my god, I can't! The door! Bro, I need to pick up his loot and I need to home. Take it all. Bro, they're both... I think they're both gonna rush me. He had two the bags though. Yeah, he's right back there. I need to prone. Bro, I cannot place the wall, no! Right, I need to salvage this door. And then I need to... Place the wall as quickly as possible, man. Yeah, he's back. I think he's mad. Yeah, there we go. Alright. I don't know what he's saying. Fuck you, mother, blade. Fuck you, father, blade. Man, shut up. Y'all are three and you guys are struggling. Shut up, bro. Honestly, shut up. Bro, these guys are pissing me off, man. I'm gonna make them rage good, I guarantee. No, they're... Yeah, they're still placing... Sta oh, they're so close. He's right under me. Alright, this dude is dead. The green skin is there. I could salvage the wall behind it and could kill him from there. But if I lose, then they would be in my base 100%. I'm gonna do that then. And he's putting music on. And shut up! There we go, he's dead. Alright, we killed so. Gotta try to kill the third. Oh, he's out in the open! Oh, they're all dead! Bro, there's no way! I killed them all! Stairs, yeah, I got their stairs. Let's take this dude's gun. Yeah, fully decked out Zob. Bro, I literally killed all three of them. Bro, I'm letting, I was lagging so much there. What the hell? Yeah, let's take this guy's gun. Bro, there's no way I beat them. Detonator! Bro, they were 
I think they were trying to come trade and they had the charges in Volt or something. Bro, I got their Deto though. Alright, so I depoled all their guns. What I'm gonna do before they come back is I'm gonna barricade all of the stairs that they built with one by ones. They wouldn't be able to climb. And whenever I can, I'll do a claim flag too. So that's what I'm gonna do next. I think it's a good idea. They wouldn't be able to climb up. They haven't been here for the last five minutes. So I think they actually lost. They actually gave up. I think that Detonate was their only Deto. And they cannot trade me. I think they had like their raiding gear in Vault or whatever, you know. Or they didn't even have raiding gear. They tried to go in deep. But they failed. So I just found this truck at Lockers, I'm gonna blow it up. This one just takes a chainsaw and it'll break. Hopefully it has some juice in it. So that three-man team, uh, two of them left. They rage quit. I can't believe it. I really did not expect them that they'll leave. And there's a Zoob, Ace, and some ammo. Alright. How's your drums too? That's crazy. But yeah, dude, two of them rage quit the server. The guy talking trash left. And the guy sniping left. It's just the third dude that was trying to build that's still here. So... GG's and easy. They were kind of killing me a lot to be honest, but then again, they were three. All right, that's Zoran numero four. Give me the good loot, baby. Wait, there's somebody in there. I hear steps. Bro, there's somebody inside. Oh, hello there. What? Wait, this was the guy that... Dude, this is their build there. This was the guy trying to build their, their stairs. Bro, I found their base. There's no way. They were trying to build right next to me, man. This is so close to my base. Oh, that's hilarious. You know what? I'm taking this base over, bro. If they build stuff in here, I'll know. I gotta charge in my vault. I'm gonna blow it up, but I gotta make more, obviously. It's not gonna be enough, but might as well damage it from now. Bro, I found out where they're trying to build. That's insane. Got a lot of metal, too. Thank you. Got 30 scrap. Alright, we're back with the uh, second charge. Give me the good loot. Come on. Okay, boat broke, and dude, there we go. Detto, Elise back. Devil's Bane. All right, I'll take that. Okay, not bad. Deto is always nice. We could do like 10 Horde Beacons. I have so many Detos in my vault and inventory and in my base. There's a dude there. I saw him, bro. Oh, there's another one. All right, this one is dead. We gotta kill the other one, though. Let's reload. Bro, these duo just came out of nowhere. I don't know where the hell he went, though. Where did he run off to, man? It's probably at the top. Yeah, he's very close to my base. Yeah, I saw him. There we go. He's dead. Check out if they had any goodies. This dude, I think, had a Snape Perisky or Zook. Oh, he had the Yuri. Never mind. He had a leather pack pack, too. Check out the first dude had. And he had Zubek. Alright. Zubek and farmer clothes. That doesn't make sense. Dead. Uh, you're evil, dog. Raw. Chainsaw. And a bunch of meds. And a fighter jet. Uh, helmet, bro. It's nice. What? Oh, he's dead. This is the same dude. He keeps coming back, bro. He has a base somewhere. Bulldog, yeah. He has to be living somewhere close. 100%. Wait, there's a dude there. 
Bro, he's so low. Oh, I have no ammo, no. It's real low, let's push him up. Yeah, he lives somewhere up here. He lives next to me, bro. Did this happen overnight, really? Right, and my boy had uh, Zubiori. Some ammo. I think he actually lives somewhere here. My base is... Yeah, there's... This 2 by one wasn't here yesterday. The hell? Oh, it's, oh yeah, you, wear, you hear him wear clothes in there. This is his base. Bro, this happened when I was sleeping. There's no way. Come on, man, open up. I'm gonna try to go deep, obviously. I don't want people living next to me, man. If this guy gets rocket launchers or whatever, he could... You know, he could be a real threat. Yeah, there we go. Alright, a threat eliminated. He was gonna come out with another Zob. Alright boys, and that is the end for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed. Now after that, nothing really happened. I still roamed around a little bit. Trying to find PvP. I did get a few kills here and there, but nothing too insane, honestly. But I hope that you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys made it till the end, I really appreciate it. I am probably currently live on Twitch as well, so make sure to come say hello. It's twitch.tv slash Liam Doz Game. Liam D-O-Z Game. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.